this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to fix if your computer will not start so it won't boot into the home screen here. So I'm just going to hold down the power button and I'm going to turn off my computer or I'm just going to go to start right now. Uh, let's turn it off and what we want to do is interrupt the starting process and if we do this twice uh, before it boots uh, we can launch it into like the recovery kind of preparing or diagnosing your hard drive or SSD kind of thing. So let's go ahead and just start it up right now by turning it on. And then when we see the symbol, I'm just going to turn it off. So I'm going to hold down the power button right now. So this should turn off my computer. Now I'm going to turn it on. When I see that symbol again, I'm just going to start holding this down. So you can do this on your desktop too. So I see the symbol, I'm going to hold it down. Now this third time when I start it up, I should boot into like the diagnostics down here. And if you have any kind of like hard drive issue, SSD issue, you should go ahead and just prepare, uh, fix that. Now if you don't see it, we can just hold it down again. So I'm going to try it one more time. I saw it loading and it should boot into it now. So I'll just allow it to load and we should see that screen pop up. So down here, preparing automatic repair. So maybe there's an issue with your drive for some reason and it's not starting up. And it'll diagnose your computer. Now if there's everything is fine, it's just gonna start up like normal. So let's say, I don't know, maybe something's wrong with Windows. You should have the option to go to a different screen and fix your problem from there on out. So if your computer's not started for whatever reason, try this out and you can force it to repair your drive. So it's connecting to the network now and I should be good to go just to start it up normally now. So let's see what happens. If your drive ran into a problem, it could be repaired. Press, uh, click, enter for the recovery options. Okay, so let's press enter. And then we can go to uh, quick machine recovery, troubleshoot. And then uh, we can go through the different options on here. Advanced options, so we can reset this PC. Uh, start up repair, fix it, uninstall updates. So we can just go through here. I think my computer will just start normally now. Let me just go ahead and go to continue. So if you run into some sort of issue, just go through the screen and should, you should be able to prompt it into that uh, blue screen like I showed you before, the recovery screen. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below.